What is up everybody, welcome back to another video. So if you have an iPad and that has keyboard problem, let's say your keyboard is not popping on the screen or keyboard doesn't respond or maybe keep getting stuck or your keyboard gets floating, then don't worry. Although we know that problem is really complicated, but in this video, we're gonna go ahead and show you an easy and quick step to fix this problem. Now let's go ahead and do the main process. Alright guys, first of all, make sure your iPad is not connected wirelessly to any keyboard. Now all you can do simply, just go ahead and type your settings and type your Bluetooth. You simply can turn off your Bluetooth to check whether it's working or not. Afterward, all you can do is just go ahead and grab that keyboard and turn it off from there as well. Now, go ahead and do the main troubleshooting process to fix that problem. First up, all you can do is just simply do a forced restart on your iPad to fix your keyboard problem. Well, this is the very basic, but that process works, let's say, 8 out of 10 times. All you can do is just go ahead and just press that volume up button and press the down button and quickly press and hold the power button and keep it holding unless you see that Apple logo appears on your iPad. Alright everyone, the next things you need to check is your keyboard full access whether those options are turned on or turned off. Now all you gotta do, tap your settings, you scroll down to your accessibility. Now find out your keyboard options right here, tap on it and tap full keyboard access and then go ahead and turn on your full keyboard access. Now at the same time, you simply can turn on increase size and high contrast. Now afterward, go ahead and check whether your keyboard is now working or not. If it still doesn't work, go ahead and check our next step. All right guys, the next things we're gonna talk about is floating keyboard on your iPad. So if you see your keyboard gets small and it's floating all around your iPad, well, that can be a little problematic thing for you. Now just quickly fix this problem. All you gotta do, just go ahead and use your two finger you can use any two finger on your hands that you want and then you can just zoom it just like that. Your keyboard will get back to normal, just like this size. And now you can start using your keyboard the way you want to use it for yourself. Okay everyone, so after checking all of this process, if you're still having problem with your keyboard on your iPad, then last but not least things that you can do, you simply can reset your keyboard on your iPad. Now to do it, tap your settings. I scroll down to your general and scroll down to your reset options you simply can tap reset keyboard dictionary so go ahead and tap it on and now tap reset dictionary once you've done that your problem will get fixed instantly now again do just go ahead and check whether it is working or not so what i'll do i'll open up a notes just to check whether it's working or not well it is completely functional right now and it is very responsive as well so let me just type something right here okay so as you guys can see this is completely functional and this is how it's working right now hope after doing all of the process your problem have solved if so be sure to hit the like button and feel free to subscribe to our fix 369 youtube channel so that you can get great video content for your gadgets so thanks for watching and see you next time